I would just say uh, when you get to college, really try to network with your professors and your classmates. You're not going to know everything and every little subject. Um, just communication. Hello, everyone. Today, I'm going to be interviewing Megan McDonald. She's a scholarship recipient of the PICPA Foundation of 2021. Megan started cross-country training in her last year in high school, and now she's running for a nationally ranked college team participating for the NCAA Division III National. And I believe right after this, you're going to for training. Is that correct, Megan? Yes, I am. That's good. I That's love, good. I love Absolutely. And she was inducted into the Beta Gamma Sigma, which is an honor society. Megan, thank you very much for agreeing for this interview, and you're going to tell us uh, how did you learn about the scholarship uh, from the PICPA? So I learned it from some of my accounting professors at Susquehanna University. Luckily, I have really great professors. They are always sending out all types of scholarships, even if they're not sure if we can apply to them or not. They just always send them out. And I am so lucky to have such a great relationship with my professors. Excellent. And why did you choose accounting as a major? So I started off by taking an accounting class in high school, and I ended up just really liking it from there. It made a lot of sense, but my dad's actually an accountant, so I didn't just wanted to pick it because he picked it. So I really tried to evaluate my choices before I got to college, and I really liked accounting because it's a skills-based major. So I know at the end of my four years at Susquehanna University that I'll have a certain skill set and I also really like how accounting is a flexible major. I can work part-time, I can work full-time. Uh, pretty much everywhere needs an accountant. <laughs> Every place needs an accountant. Absolutely. So, yeah. I like what you said about the skill set, and that's what differentiate accounting from other majors like econ or finance. You learn something that's useful. You learn how to prepare a 1040. You learn how to conduct an audit, and those are actual skills that you would use in the real world. Also, Megan, it's full-time, part-time, and also you can be self-employed. You can open your own business, and that's what that's my next question to you. Are you planning to go for your CPA exam eventually? Yes, I'm planning on uh, going for my CPA exam after my four years at Susquehanna University. Uh, luckily, I have good professors that um, I'm able to get it in four years instead of five years or six years at some other institutions. So you will be completing the 150 credits in four years. Yes. That's impressive. That's impressive. And I'm assuming you took financial accounting, managerial accounting at this point, correct? So correct. you're familiar with the curriculum. What advice would you give to accounting students that are starting or non-accounting say, okay, accounting is, is good for you. What would you say? I would just say uh, when you get to college, really try to network with your professors and your classmates. You're not going to know everything and every little subject. Um, just communication is the biggest aspect to it. And I would also say just go to your career center and they have tons of different things for you. Uh, we did a thing that is called Breakthrough at my school. We took a big tour bus to New York City and we could network with alumni there um, and just tour different companies. And it just really opens your eyes to all your different options. So I would just definitely say that networking is the biggest aspect. So networking and through networking, I 100% agree to that. You're going to examine all your options, your, all the diversity. And this is when you learn about your major. Megan, thank you so much for your time. Would we'll let you go for your training. Train hard. Good luck. And thank you so much for this, uh, for agreeing to interview with us. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you.